dangerous new drug turning up in Tennessee has officials on high alert tonight. It does. It is called wasp spray dope. Not only is it illegal, but as News Channel 5's Chris Conti found out, those who use it for a high are doing some incredibly stupid things. It's all new at 6. 16 year old Kanan Johnson was hoping for a quiet Christmas break. I'm crazy. <laughs> he did not get his wish. We were making cookies and he just came in the side door. Two weeks ago, officials say Danny Hollis walked into his family's farmhouse in Lawrenceburg. He came over here and got a drink of water and then he was like mumbling around and stuff. Hollis then removed a knife from the butcher block and cut his throat. And my mom was like, you're bleeding on all of our stuff. Like, can you not? From there, an all out ransacking began. First, he threw a dresser down the stairs. From the stairs and threw it and hit the wall and busted it. Then jumped out a second story window, landing on a gazebo, breaking his neck. Danny Hollis, though, wasn't done. And then one of our friends pulled in the driveway because we're making cookies. And so we're like, get out of here, get out of here. At one point, Danny Hollis left the house through the front door and started chasing after the family down the street. By the time deputies got here, Danny was up in this tree completely naked. And as deputies were trying to tase him, he was throwing fecal matter at them back onto the ground. What's going through your mind? This is crazy. It was like a movie. So it took us all by surprise. Undercover officer Zach Ferguson wasn't just shocked by what Danny Hollis did. We call it wall spray dope. He also can't believe what Danny Hollis took that caused him to go crazy. Uh, they can make it look like crystal meth. Wasp spray dope is essentially crystallized wasp spray cut with meth. It's dangerous and easy to make. But it seems to be spreading rapidly. Officer Ferguson is worried people are getting meth laced with wasp spray and not knowing it. I mean, you can imagine what it would do to the human body. When you see what it did to this guy, can you believe that anyone would want to take this drug? No. Never. Kanan Johnson was hoping for a quiet Christmas break. Instead, he got one he can't forget. Chris Conti, News Channel 5. Wasp spray dope is so new that officials don't know the long-term effects it might have. Tonight, Danny Hollis remains in jail.